Hey guys, the logo finally came in the mail. Oh my goodness. And I did mention in previous videos that um, I couldn't afford to buy a brand new baby, but I could afford to buy some new bodies so I can upgrade. So that's what I've done. Um, I have a few babies already in mind that I want to upgrade. And I think I bought like two extras or one extra. Can't remember. So start off. This is a 16 inch full limbs. I have a preemie, a preemie that I would love to upgrade into a new body. It's just my invoice. You don't need to see that. <laughs> this one is a 18 inch full limbs as well. Now they're upgraded. Um, so the first one was 16, that one was 18. I also bought a second 18. Now, the babies that I want to try, I did make sure, because sometimes you can buy, like, um, uh, like this is a full-limbed hip, no joints. But there's also like a full limb, like this one, front loading. This is non-jointed, but I'm preferring that I don't like the joints. So I like the non-jointed. Sorry, my camera is going in and out of focus, but um, I have some bodies that are like side loaders. And front, um, what are they called? Front loaders. <laughs> but I do like these new bodies because they're, like, they have the tapered chest and they'll have, like, a booty shape. So I like that. Um, this is a 22-inch full limb, non-jointed, front loading. This is, I had this one planned for a while, so I finally got that ordered for myself. And these are, oh, another, um, yeah, I really wanted a 20-inch full limbs front-loading non-jointed, but they didn't have any in stock. So I thought, eh, I'll just buy another 22 and see if it works or not. If it doesn't work, then that's fine. I have an extra body. So, but these two are cuddled babies. I have a 14 inch cuddle baby uh, preemie. Um, I do have um, an older, older doll that I've tried to um, fix uh, the body. It was like kind of big for him. So I, I also have this too, this 16. I will try this 16 on him first and if he still doesn't look like, if it's still looking a little odd, then I'll go with the smaller body. Because normally preemies have a bigger head anyway, right? So, I'll see. If I'm not happy with the 18-inch replacement body, I will put him on this 14-inch cuddle body. I didn't realize this, but when I open these, I have to... So on the legs and all that myself. I didn't know that. I opened them and I'm like, oh, did I order the right thing? And then I also got myself a 22 inch cuddle baby. So I do have a doll that I want. It's that doll that um I didn't like the um uh, the limbs on it. So I thought, hey, I'll turn her into a cuddle baby. So. And then I ordered, of course, I have to order myself more of these. So um, this time I will be cutting these up and putting them inside of the bodies. Excuse my foot. 
And I also, I don't know if this will work, but I have a creamy doll that needs new eyelashes. And these were on sale, and they're only like three fifty. dollars That's so cheap. So I thought, I wonder if these will just, what if I, but the thing is, I don't know if it will work because the baby I want to do this to is to my partial silicone. So I don't know if these stick on silicone or not. I have no idea. I should have, I should have tried to figure that out before I bought these. But I think they were on sale even cheaper than this, uh, like $2 or something. So I thought, eh, for $2, that's fine if they don't work. But maybe if I even, like, poke these in. I don't know. I don't know what I'm doing. So I'll show you the baby who I'm thinking of. She is, okay, I'll get her. She's in, she's in there. Uh, so here is one of my preemie girls. She is very, very preemie. And she is meant to look like a preemie. She has no hair. She's bald. But um, she is a little warrior sculpt by Angela Lewis. And I love her. Um... She is like so tiny, but like her mouth opened. Oh, um, she's missing eyelashes. She has like a little there, but she's missing. She's missing. But I don't know if these will work. I just thought that. I would like love to try it and see Oops. if these will work on her. I don't know if they do. They'll probably just like totally just come off. But I do own a rooting needle and I do have a little bit of hair. But I don't like rooting and I'm not I've never tried to root eyelashes. I mean, I could look it up on YouTube probably, but I just thought, eh, for a fast solution, why not try this? But I don't know. I don't know if that will work. If it won't work, please let me know what you think. But, um, yeah, it's a beautiful day. Let's see. Beautiful day. So yeah, she's just so cute. I don't have anyone in the car seat. There's my car seat right there. Um, no one's in it. Guess what, guys? I am expecting a Nino baby. That is uh, uh, by Chenza Dolls Sculpt. The, the one with dwarfism. I'm really excited. Um... Yay, she should be here. Actually, she should be here already, but our mail is so slow. I've been waiting for this since I think I ordered this order like in mid January and I finally got it like at the end of February. It took them a whole month and they are in Canada. <sighs> so, our Canada post is so slow. But, anyways, guys, I should go for now. I have a lot of things to do. Well, I can't wait for spring break, I'll tell you that. I will do a video with her. I want to change her. She's wearing her original outfit that she came home in with me. I love it. But I do have some things I would love to put her in. So maybe she could be the star of the seat until I get my Nino baby. And it will be a girl. The Nino is coming to me as a girl. I have... A first name picked out I don't have a middle name yet but I'm very excited I can't wait for her to be here I think I'll wait until the name pops into my head so we'll see but anyways guys I hope that you have a great day thank you so much for being here and spending some time with me 
and watching my finally my thing that came my order that came but yes I'm so happy I was able to find the funds to get my next baby can't wait for that hope you guys are well and take care love you guys wave to you guys match hand match hand guys love you